you'll know within a few short minutes after walking down the hallways whether this is a place you see your loved one living. Inspection reports revealing what life is like inside some local nursing homes and what's uncovered can be concerning. Now we show you how you can access these critical records before you transition a loved one into a care facility. This information is also important for those of us that already have a family member in a nursing home. The inspection reports giving you a snapshot essentially of what life is like on the inside. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester here with us now and Hank this is very useful information. It is. These are some of the reports that we pulled offline. There is a lot of information. Hundreds of facilities throughout the state of Michigan as you would expect. Some have great ratings others don't. The good news all of this information is free and available for you to review. These inspection reports from inside local nursing homes revealing surprising information from the cleanliness of the kitchen to the risk of falls, allegations of elder abuse. It is all laid out. It can be hard to read. The reports rating everything from the cleanliness of the facility to the patient to staff ratio. It is all critical information that you should review before faced with a difficult decision. Before you, you know, go to a nursing home, do your research. Doing the research now easier than ever before because of online tools like these. The state and federal government both required to inspect nursing homes. Those inspection reports posted online, the information is free. What types of policies, procedures they have, what is the level of their staffing, what is the qualification of their staffing, what are their infection control measures, what are their care, um, you know, what kind of care are they providing. You have access to all of these reports and the five star grading scale makes it easy for you to see where some facilities are making the grade and where others are failing. Go and visit, uh, talk to the residents, talk to the owners, you know, talk to the care staff, uh, get a feel for that. Finding the right place for your loved one can be challenging. It's an emotional decision that sometimes needs to be made quickly. Yes, it needs to be clean. Yes, you want it to be well lit, you want it to be joyous, but the most important thing is watch the people. Look at the residents, the other residents in there. Are they happy? Are they clean? Are they dressed at 8, 30, 9 o'clock or are they all still in their pajamas? Wendy Jones is with Next Steps for Seniors. We need to all have some type of regulatory system to be accountable to. And I think it's a great tool to have because we know that the state is keeping an eye on what's going on. Wendy's company helps families in that transition point to locate the right care facility. And while she and state investigators agree, the information in these reports is helpful. Nothing beats seeing a nursing home for yourself. It's a good tool to use, but it's also a better tool to, to have a personal relationship and to get in there and meet the people. We put a link to the website with all the inspection reports on our website. Click on Detroit.com. Just head over to the Help Me Hank page. Again, it is very useful information. There's a lot to read. Mm -hmm. uh, but, you know, as we heard from a few different people in that story, nothing beats getting an eye and taking a walk through the facility yourself. Exactly. you got to go with your gut, too, yeah, right? Yeah, true. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Hank.